Hey, this is Mustafa, Customer Success Manager at Sell the Trend. In this quick video, I want to go through a couple new exciting features we have added to Sell the Trend shops. So those features are coupons, discount pop-up, and MailChimp integration. So in order to configure coupons, you have to click on the configure button over here, then add new coupon. So there are three kinds of coupons that are being offered on Sell the Trend. So this is a fixed coupon, this is a percentage coupon, and this is a free shipping coupon. So in order to create a percentage coupon, you have to type in the coupon name, coupon code, coupon discount, and those coupon discounts can be applied on all products, a specific product or a specific collection. Then you can set a start date and an end date for the coupon. Then you can click on save button. So this is how the coupon looks like when you create a coupon. So in order to configure coupon code in your store, you have to add the item in your cart. So this is how it looks like. So, so the coupon code over here is 50 off. So let's type 50 off. As you can see that the 50% coupon discount has successfully been applied. So now let us discuss about the discount pop-up feature. So this is how the discount pop-up feature would look like on your store. So in order to configure the discount pop-up feature, you have to click on the configure button over here. And then you can see that this is a discount pop-up feature and this is the enable exit intent feature. So what th this feature does is that whenever the user is trying to, you know, exit the store, so he'll be shown a pop-up. This is a pop-up timer feature. So what this feature does is that basically whenever the user is in your store for 30 seconds, so after 30 seconds, he'll be shown a pop-up. This is the show pop-up teaser feature. Here you can customize your title text, your email text, and your button text. And then you can finally click on the save all button. Let's talk about the MailChimp integration feature. So you can actually run email marketing campaigns on your shop. So whenever customers are typing in the email over here, so those emails will straightly be configured into the MailChimp account over here. So in order to configure MailChimp account, you can always click on the configure button over here. So here you can type in the username and the password. And if you don't have a MailChimp account, you can always create a free MailChimp account and get access to 2000 emails. So that's it. I hope you enjoyed watching this quick video. See you in the next one.